This video shows the cleaning of the resin tray after printing. After printing, at the latest at the end of the working day, the photopolymer must be filled back into the bottle. Since small particles can fall into the liquid photopolymer, during printing, it is important to filter it, when filling it back. Insert the steel funnel with the attached strainer into the bottle. Pour the remaining material over one edge of the tray into the steel funnel with the attached strainer. Use the silicone vat spatula included in the accessory kit, to push material residues together and also fill them into the bottle. In this way, you avoid disposing of more material than is necessary. After as much material as possible has been filled back into the bottle, the residues of the black and insensitive part of the resin tray can be removed with a paper towel that is as wood-free as possible. Be careful not to touch the projector window with the sensitive foil. Now add some isopropanol to the resin tray and let it act for a short time. Then remove the coarse residue from the black area. Now apply enough isopropanol to the projector window so that the glass pane is covered and let it work for at least 5 minutes. This allows the isopropanol to dissolve the remaining photopolymer in the grooves between the resin tray and the glass. Now material residues can be removed from the surface of the resin tray with the isopropanol using a soft, wood-free paper towel. Fill the resin tray again with enough isopropanol to cover the projector window. After a short contact time, the clean isopropanol can be poured out to the side. Make sure that the material film starts to tear at the upper right edge and pulls off to the bottom left. If necessary, remove the remaining drops of isopropanol from the surface and dry the remaining parts of the tray. This gives you a streak-free result without scratching the film in the projector window. The resin tray is now ready for the next material and the next print. The cleaning of the resin tray is necessary for every material exchange.